Good evening. So honored guests, parents, Calabasas school staff, please rise and welcome Calabasas class of 2028 students.
Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, please remain standing for the playing of our national anthem. seats. Okay. And I would like to welcome everyone to this special event. Well, my name is Jonathan Chavez and I am the proud principal of Calabasas School. At this time, I would like to acknowledge our distinguished guests who have played such a critical role in the success of the students who sit here before you. First, former principal and current uh, SCV 35, I'm, I'm, excuse me, um, SCV 35, um, uh, guys, I'm sorry. Uh, the superintendent, uh, uh, Mr. David Verdugo. Uh, assistance. Uh, Superintendent, Mr. Stephen Shadler. <laughs> Assistant, uh, Superintendent, Dr. Melissa Lunderville. <laughs> uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Rudy. Uh, Mr. Rudy. Amolera, County Supervisor, District Number Two. Ms. Lourdes Vasquez, Governing Board Clerk. Mr. Joel Kramer, Governing Board Member. And I would also like to recognize any of our district leaders that are also joining us tonight. I'm Mr. Dagoberto Lopez, Principal of Cuatimundi Middle School. 
is Talia Tolano, Rio Rico High School, assistant principal. Ms. Megan Padilla, TLA coordinator. Ms. Rebecca Cabrera, human resource director. And Ms. Shannon Hall, our communications director. I would also like to recognize our Calabasas leadership team, Ms. Vanessa Alegria Rivas, assistant principal. Mr. Richard Orman, who is also the assistant principal. Ms. Julie Ballard, instructional coach. Ms. Marcia Amaguirre, instructional coach. Ms. Amy Camp, middle school counselor. And Mr. Joseph Butler, coordinator of athletics. And so I would also like to thank all of our ladies in our front office that helped put things together for today's ceremony. Ms. Susie Fanning, Ms. Virgie Karamsad, and the Queen of Calabasas, who is not here with us, Ms. Annette Garcia. I would also like to welcome and honor our Calabasas teachers and staff. So if you can please stand, if you're a Calabasas teacher or staff team member, if you could please stand. Students, parents, teachers, and our honors guests. Today is one of the days that you will remember for the rest of your life. There are some of you Cougars who have been together since you were in kinder or even preschool. You have built a ton of memories over the years you have spent at Calabasas School. For many of you students, Calabasas is the only school you have ever known. I am so excited to help you all make the next step in your educational journey, the journey into high school. I have had the privilege to have been with you since you were all in fourth grade. Fourth grade, you guys. Ever since then, you have always been welcoming and truly made me feel home at Calabasas. Calabasas is home to me. We have gone through a pandemic together, and many trials and tribulations. And now I am standing here before you as my very first promotion class as a principal. You will always hold a very special place in my heart, you guys. As a former Cougar, my brothers who are in the stands are also Cougars as well. Our family loves our school. It is my hope that as you all move forward with the rest of your life, that you look back at the memories formed throughout your entire time at Calabasas with your teachers, with your friends, with any of the family members that you went to school with, and look at those as great memories, friendships, and relationships that you will carry on for the rest of your life. As you look around you today, I want you to think about your family. I want you to think about your families and all of the support that they have provided for you by getting you to school when you were feeling lazy and did not want to get up, getting you to and from practices or after school activities at school, going to family conferences and being there when you needed them. That, you guys, is love. Your families love you. I look forward to seeing all of the wonderful things that you will do as you make the transition into high school. I will be following you guys all very closely to see all of those amazing things that you will do. Just know that I, as well as all of your Calabasas faculty, will be here to support you, always. Don't forget all the good memories with your friends that you have built during your time at Calabasas.
but know that you are just getting started and will have so many more cherished memories to create. Make the choice to have those memories be the best that they can be. You have many important choices coming up. Don't be afraid to ask questions. Advocate for yourself. And know that you will have the ability to start forming who you will be for the rest of your life, starting now. I want to wish you all the best in high school. And don't forget to stand tall and show our Calabasas pride every day. Congratulations, class of 2028. I am very proud of you and all of the accomplishments that you have made up to this point. Cougar pride. So it is my honor to welcome former principal, Mr. David Verdugo. Right, thank you, Mr. Chavez. Yes, I was the principal at Calabasas for eight years, which is one of my favorite, actually probably my favorite job of all time. Um, although I love being superintendent, being principal at Calabasas was, was very special for me. Um, so good evening, esteemed guests, proud families, uh, dedicated faculty, and most importantly, our exceptional Calabasas Middle School Transition Class of 2024. The day marks a significant milestone in the lives of our students. It is a day of celebration, reflection, and anticipation as we honor the achievements of our eighth graders who are ready to embark on the next chapter of their educational journey. To the parents, guardians, and families, we thank you for your unwavering support and dedication. You have provided guidance, encouragement, and love. Your involvement in your children's education has been, has been crucial to their success. To the faculty and staff of Calabasas, your commitment to nurturing the educating and educating these students has been extraordinary. You have challenged them to think critically, encouraged them to strive for excellence, and supported them in their growth. Your passion and dedication have made a profound impact on their lives, and for that we are immensely grateful. Students, as you transition to high school, you are stepping into a world of new opportunities and exciting possibilities. High school will bring new challenges, new friends, and new experiences. It is time for you to explore your interests and discover your passions and continue building the foundation for your future. Remember the skills and knowledge you have gained in middle school as they will serve you as well as you take on the new adventures. Congratulations, Calabasas Middle School Class of 2024 and future Rio Rico High School Class of 2028. This is not the end, but a new beginning, and we are incredibly proud of you. Excited to see all the amazing things you will achieve in high school and beyond. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Verdugo. It is now my pleasure to welcome former Calabasas teacher, Ms. Lourdes Vasquez. Hi guys, good evening. Good evening to everybody. It is a pleasure to be here with you as we celebrate this important milestone in your lives. Eighth grade graduation marks a significant transition and I am honored to share in this ex exciting moment with you. Uh, to all transitioning students, Today is proof that you, that your hard work, dedication, and growth over the past years, you faced challenges, learned new things, and built friendships that have helped shape who you are. You've shown strength and courage, especially in times when the world seemed uncertain. These qualities will serve you well as you move forward into high school and beyond. High school is a time of exploration, and discovery. It's an opportunity to search and explore deeper into your interests, developing new skills, and start to carve out the path you want to take in life. Embrace the challenges and opportunities that come your way. Remember that it is okay to make mistakes because mistakes are part of the learning process. And actually, they are often the best teachers. As you learn, as you stand 
on the edge of this new chapter. Know that you have a strong foundation beneath you. Your teachers, your family, and friends have all contributed to your journey, providing support and guidance. Take their lessons with you, but also be ready to create your own path. Believe in yourselves and your ability to achieve great things. Stay curious, stay kind, and keep striving to be the best version of yourselves. The future is bright, and you have the potential to take it, make it even brighter. Remember that behind you are all of your memories. Before you are all of your dreams. Around you are all who love you. And within you is all that you need to succeed. Congratulations, okay, to each and every one of you. We are incredibly proud of your accomplishments and can't wait to see what you will achieve next. Thank you. Way to go, Cougars. Thank you very much, Ms. Vasquez. At this point, I would like to invite Mr. Joseph Butler to the podium to announce the Calabasas Student Athlete of the Year. My name is Joseph Butler and I have been in the district for six years and I've had the honor and privilege to teach and coach many of these fine eighth graders. I will be presenting the award of Calabasas Athletes of the Year. The following student athletes were nominated by their coaches. Please stand when you hear your name. Lexis Astorga. <laughs> Nazareth Ortiz. Andrea Acosta, Camila Gomez, Fernando Alvidres, Brayden Chavez, Angelo Granados, and Ivan Arvizu. All of these athletes nominated have stood out in their respective sports have great character, and have been outstanding citizens of Calabasas. Please give them a round of applause. And the award for Calabasas Athletes of the Year goes to Angelo Granados and Andrea Acosta. I wish you all to continue your athletic pursuits in high school, challenge yourself, play multiple sports, and always make the most of your opportunities. Thank you very much. Great pleasure to welcome Mr. Richard Orman to the podium to announce our Cougar of the Year Award. Congratulations, Cougars. Good evening. The following words have been used by our eighth grade team to describe our 2024 Calabasas Cougar of the Year. She is tenacious, thorough, and her school work is consistently exemplary. She is thoughtful and insightful and is able to articulate her ideas powerfully. She is reserved but kind and has had a positive impact on her schoolmates and her teachers. The 2024 Calabasas Cougar of the Year, Estefania Lopez.
congratulations to Stefania. Well deserved. At this time, I would like to introduce Mr. Santiago Valenzuela, eighth grade, class Duco president, who will now address his fellow classmates. and I am your student council president. I am honored to stand up here today representing my class who is, who is moving on to the next step in our lives, high school. Before I get into all that, I would like to say thank you to all our mentors in life. To all our mentors in life, such as our principals, teachers, and faculty members, because I know a lot of you look up to them as I look up to a few myself. I would also like to give a huge thank you to all the parents and guardians who are here tonight. You have all shaped us to be the best versions we can be. I know that without my parents, I wouldn't be the person that I am today. So from my classmates to you, thank you parents and guardians for guiding us in these stages of our lives. High school will be a new and challenging adventure. It is where our experiences from middle school will guide us in making decisions on upcoming events. Also, it will help us find new interests, make new friends, and take on new challenges. High school is a place where all of us will grow and change our future. Not only our own future, but the future of the world for a better making. So as we all go into this new stage in our lives, let's go at it with an open heart because I know we are ready to experience the things ahead of us. To experience the new things ahead of us, a place where we can all encourage each other to explore the curiosities that this world has to offer. I know that with an open mind, we can all do whatever we set our hearts to, whether it's being the best chef you can be to being the best lawyer in the state. I believe that everyone in this ceremony, in this ceremony can accomplish anything as long as we set our heart, mind, and soul into it. We shall put as much effort into what we like to do, just how we did in middle school. So with that, congratulations to us all and in this great achievement. Let's look forward to this next step with curiosity. Thank you. Well done, Santiago, well done. At this time, we will now commence with the presentation of certificates. Parents, I would like to request that you do not pop confetti poppers or streamers in the stands or after the ceremony on the field, please. Students, first row, please stand. Please welcome school counselor, Ms. Amy Kemp, who will read the names of our students. Mabel Alvarez. <laughs> Andrea Acosta. Santiago Agunde. Sebastián Agunde.
Diego Ainza. Elvia Altamirano. Isaac Álvarez. Fernando Alvidres. Jacob Hawkins. Andrea Aramburo Villarreal. Alberto Arrochi. Fernanda Arredondo. Iván Arbizu. Lexis Astorga. Joseph Avila. Anaís Áviles. David Barragán. Andrea Barrio Nuevo. Isamar Bermúdez. Olivia Bustamante. Darena Cantúa. Fernanda Casas Carvajal. Jonas Román David Castro. Mary Jane Castro. Mia Cervantes. Brayden Chavez. Yael Chavez. Brian Clark. Carolina Ea. Roberto Corte. Cristian Cota 
Godoy. Mariana Cruz. Benjamín Díaz. Emily Domínguez Hernández. Valentín Domínguez Sozoya. Marco Duarte Valdés. Brianna Esquivel. Alec Estrada Zamora. Ray Félix. Paloma Pontes. Brayden García. Isabela García. Paola García García. Helen Castellum Rivas. Camila Gómez. Sebastián González. Anthony Grams. Angelo Granados. Claudia Eras González. Cristian Hernández. David Hernández. Emilio Hernández. Patricio Hernández. Vamos, Emilio. Carlos Hernández Fuentes. Michael Hinojosa. Islava Adán Juárez Luis Fernando Ledesma Emma Lizárraga. Estefanía López. Salatiel López.
Arturo Machuca. Paquina Madrid Carranza. Gerardo Tony Martínez. Monique Martínez. Andrew Martinez Stewart. Itzel Medina Gallego. Nicole Mendivil Fierro. Romeo Mendoza. Jacob Mendoza. Alejandro Merino. Isabela. Mireles López. Geraldi Molina. Daniel Monroy Villalobos. Jessica Moreno. Sofía Morgan Romero. Jesús Navarro. Nazaret Ortiz Santiago Pacheco Víctor Pérez Jesús Portillo Ashley Hui Martín Quijada Yara Quiñones Quintero García José Alberto Ramírez Meredith Rascón César Robles Jesús Gerardo Rodríguez. Lexis Rodríguez. Miguel Rodríguez. Camila Romero. Santiago Romero Araceli Rubalcaba Ro 
Rodrigo Salazar. Daniel Soto Barón. Gael Soto Mange. Camila Tadori Lucero. Santiago Valenzuela Jesús Vázquez Andrea Vía Camila Yáñez Natalia Yepis Eric Zamora Camila Zubiate Ledesma If I could please have Miss Atolano to the stage, please. Miss Claudia Atolano, Assistant Principal, Rio Rico High School. Congratulations, Class 20 of 2028. Extremely proud of you guys. Miss Claudia Atolano, Assistant Principal at Rio Rico High School. The eighth grade students of Calabasas School have met the state and the district requirements to be promoted to high school. It is with great pleasure that I present to you the Calabasas promoted eighth graders and new Rio Rico High School class of 2028. I have heard many great things about this class and I expect these students will thrive academically at Rio Rico High School. Welcome to the nest, Hawks class of 2028. Thank you, Ms. Tolano. Students, once again, congratulations. Families, congratulations. Felicidades a todas las familias de nosotros. Students, I am extremely proud of you. And at this point, you're dismissed. <laughs>